Hey everyone, so I was just about to make some homemade popsicles for my son using our Vitamix. Um, I just wanted to talk about it real quick and then I will throw the ingredients in and blend them up. Um, so we've had this for a few years and we really love this blender. We use it for tons of different things, um, tons of smoothies, uh, soups. We use it as a food processor as well. Um, it works great for everything. Um, so there are 10 speed options you can put it on high which is just top speed or you can do variable and choose a speed um it holds up to eight cups which um shows on the side here this side is measured in cups or ounces and then on the other side of the blender it shows the measurements in milliliters um and then of course the top has a removable part <laughs> so that you can um add ingredients in without having to remove the full lid um, so yeah, I'm going to get my ingredients in and I will show you this thing in action. Okay, so I have my ingredients in. I have two pounds of fresh sliced strawberries in here, a um, couple handfuls each of frozen mango and avocado, and then a little bit of plain Greek yogurt and some honey on top. Um, there's no other liquid or anything added in, so I'm going to go ahead and blend it up. I'll do it. I'll do some on high and variable just so you can get a feel for both. Okay, so all blended, just so you can see the consistency that it came out. And I blended probably longer than I needed to, just to show it, but um, probably about 45 seconds. 30 seconds would have probably been plenty. But yeah, we love this blender. It has a ton of different uses. Um, definitely recommend it, and I'm sure you can find uh, even more things to use it for as well.